Yo, what's happening, people? Okay, we is back once again with another video, and this time it is something different, something sentimental. Cyanide and happiness shorts. Okay, so this was recommended. A shout out to everybody sending through recommendations. If you've got a recommendation or something that you want me to do a reaction to, or any types of videos you want to see in the channel, then send it through. I'll see what I can do. Like, share, subscribe because we are doing this tenure. Get me, fam. But for now, something sentimental, sign and happiness. Now, here's the thing I have kind of known about sign and happiness, but only because, like, I've seen people post, like, you know, clips and images and things like that on Twitter and Instagram and places like that. I did not know it was its own thing. I mean, I guess in hindsight, like, duh, right? But I didn't know it was its own thing. Certainly didn't know it was called Sign and Happiness, but this was sent through and I saw the image and I was like, ah, I've seen those kind of characters before. So that must be what it is, Sign and Happiness. So, I want to be happy. I'm not sure I want to take cyanide, though. But anyway, let's see what these guys are doing and uh, we'll go from there. Making the world. Hey, a you wanna place. touch something? No! Cool, let me uh, come back a little bit because I just gonna miss a slow. Here we go. Here we go. Hey, you wanna touch something? No! I don't! I don't wanna see anything, taste anything, smell anything, or hear anything! Alright, so this is the first time I'm watching one of their videos, like I said, I've seen some of the images posted around and things like that. Um so I'm not familiar with what they do, but I'm guessing this gentleman on the left of the screen has a history of asking inappropriate questions. <laughs> because he just asks if you want to touch something, which, I mean, that could be taken all kinds of ways, to be honest. But the way this guy on the right responded suggests that he's asked him to do various things before and it hasn't turned out so well. But those of you who are more familiar with sound and happiness, then uh, let me know how correct I am. Perhaps we'll find out in this video. We'll see. We'll see. And I sure as hell don't want to touch whatever it is you want me to touch. <sighs> well, if it's a donut. Man, if you spent even a tenth of the time you spent annoying me on helping other people, you could really make a difference in the world. Like I'm trying to. Is he, though? Is he? We'll see. <laughs> Oh, you upset him though. Oh, wait, what's this? Pause for a second. Sometimes it goes too fast. So I've got to pause it and read it. Timely news 2020. Man sees something, says something. <laughs> Another man creates color blind glasses. Well, I mean, why not? Why not? <laughs> What's that sketch actually? Was it Rudy Man Man Mascuso? Um, I think it's Rudy Mascuso. I can't. I'm, I'm sorry if I'm saying his name wrong, but it's a guy. I might. I'll still can find the link. But there's a sketch by a guy, and he does this thing called. Um, I think it's called like the racist glasses or something like that. They're, or the or the stereotype glasses or something. But you put up while you just see racial stereotypes. But yeah, I'll put a link in the description if I can find it. But I guess that's the opposite of what this guy did. <laughs> that's it. Uh, local hero tastes something. Stops restaurant food poisoning. Lesser men at fees third world countries. Okay, okay. Oh, that's 2032. Okay, we're in the future. 2043. Um, genius man hears something, saves boy. Some guy develops free hair and aid. Okay, okay. What have we got here? Oh, there's a bit more words now. Um, this is 2053. Okay, so mythical man smells something smoky, rescues an entire building. Lame nerd cures. Old, old factory cancer. Okay. Okay, world mourns death of absolute legend. Ah, oh, does 2076. Jealous old bear quits <laughs> old eyes. He was a thoughtful and infinitely caring man, a pillar of our community and an inspiration to the world. His impact on the lives he saved and enriched will continue on through generations to come. <laughs> Let this great man be a reminder to us all that regardless of one's past, no matter how much you annoy one specific person, maybe in a nondescript white room setting, perhaps with ridiculous Pee Wee Herman style Rube Goldberg devices, possibly <laughs> featuring a vast array of mechanical white glove contraptions, Sounds or familiar. maybe not like this at all. Let us remember that whatever your past sins may be, it's never too late to change one's ways and work your best to make the world a better place. 
Well, ain't that the truth, isn't it? Like, no matter what you've done in the past, you could always improve, you could always do better, you could always change your ways, and you could always do something amazing. It's never too late to start something new. You've got to plant the seeds now, and then one day the flower blossoms into something awesome and amazing. So, uh, but you've got to start. You never fit, you, you'll never finish if you don't start. So, um, yeah, but we'll see where we're going with this. It's come back just a tiny little bit. And work I think that's a joke coming. To make the world a better place. Thinking back on his generous spirit, creativity, and bravery, I guess you could say he touched us all. Oh. <laughs> uh, feeling bad now, huh? Pretty touching, huh? Oh, oh, come on. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, snap. Okay. Oh, wait, it's not finished. Okay. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay, now it's finished. Okay. <laughs> you know what? That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. I like that. So that was cyanide and happiness. Uh, more happiness than cyanide, which is a good thing because I, I don't think cyanide would have ended so well, to be honest with you. But that's pretty cool. I like that. You know, it's kind of started off in a way where I guess you kind of assume in somewhat that he's going to do something really inappropriate or also do something really inappropriate. But at the end of it, it's like, well, actually, not quite, not quite. But it did have a nice kind of story arc and a nice kind of uh, message as well. So, uh, yeah, you just, you know, try to do your best in life. You know, try to do what you can while you can because, well, we ain't going to be here forever. So whatever time we have is all we have to do, all, the, all that we can do. So, uh, yeah, I like that. That was pretty cool. Cyanide and Happiness Short, something sentimental. You get the thumbs up you get the thumbs up but yeah big up for all the recommendations if you've got any videos that you want to do reactions to any types of videos you want to see the channel then send it through and i see what i can do like share subscribe because we are doing this thing yeah you get me fam i've got more videos over there other channels over there comedy channel movie slash video game channel check them out be much appreciated but that's gonna be it for the minute so guys until whenever if ever peace